you will need to open Automation License Manager on both machines. I will wait. Now what you need to do is check what the IP address of your local machine is and your remote machine. How I typically do it is I go down to my wireless, then I go to Open Network and Sharing Center, and then I click on my LAN connection. It could be a gigabit or whatever your computer is set up for. Then you will then click on detail. This is where you would find your IP address. And now you need to check on your other station. I will wait. This is my remote station, 192.168.0.200. I will now try to ping it from the other computer. Now back on the local machine, I will close out of all these windows and I'm going to open up a command prompt and I'm going to ping 192. 168.0.200. There's one, two, three, four, success. Awesome. Still on the local machine. And open up ALM. I will wait. Now you're going to click Edit, Connect Computer, and then you will type in the IP address of the remote PC, 192.168.0.200, the one that you just pinged. Now we're connected. We can see the other computer. See? C drive. It has a license. Now let's go to the remote computer and connect to the host machine. I will wait. Same thing. Go to Edit, Connect Computer, and type in the IP address of the host machine. Now you should be able to transfer licenses from the local machine to the remote machine and vice versa. Look, there's the D drive on the host machine. I see step 7 V14. Let's transfer it to the C drive on the remote machine. Now let's go to the remote machine and see that it's there. Ta-da! Now that you have transferred everything, you are now an expert.